a person asked me a question of uh, how consistently do I feed my rabbit or at what interval do I feed my rabbit and I thought that it's good for me to share with us on uh, how to feed your rabbit especially in the area of the consistency and at which interval do you feed your rabbit so it's important for you as a farmer to understand such kind of topics so my name is Emmanuel and welcome to the channel feel free to subscribe to it if you haven't subscribed and also like our videos and share our videos part I'll be just sharing a short video on a, a feeding intervals on when to feed your rabbit and when to not feed your rabbit so basically uh, different people uh, do feed dif uh, their rabbit in different way and uh, each and every person has his own way of feeding his or her own rabbit but um, apart from doing that there are uh, some consistent that you need to do as a farmer in order for you to maximize the production in your rabbit uh, in your rabbit and then um, these things are so crucial and you need to be following them so you just don't uh, uh, put whole food in the rabbit and then you just go and then you just leave it maybe like one to two days without attending to it so you need to understand on the, at what interval do you feed your rabbit and the, how, to, how, how do you do like uh, such kind of a thing so basically uh, it's important for you to understand as, as in a, just like a, a human being rabbit need to be fed at interval you need to give it food in the morning and in the evening so uh, the amount of food that you give your rabbit will depend on the kind of system that it, you, are, you have adopted as a farmer so uh, the first thing that you need to do is um, during you need to feed your rabbit in the morning and in the evening as I said um, in the morning uh, basically you can uh, choose either to give them pellets or hay um, and in the evening also you can choose either to give them pellets or hay or if you are using green in that matter in, uh, in greens in that matter so as for me I usually do I usually give them pellets during morning and the hay during evening so i usually minimize on the greens because of the some reason that i shared with you and um, maybe the cost of getting such kind of greens and then um, maybe the things to do with them um, disease that they come with the green so so i usually limit as much as i can the amount of greens that i give my rabbit so i usually concentrate on the pellets and the, the and the hay so as for hay you, you need to give it as much as you as, as you can so that your rabbit can be able to feed on the on, so on the dry matters that is on fibers because uh, hay contains a lot of fiber in that way but uh, for pellets you need to regulate them you need to give them a, a small amount of quantity of pellets uh, so that uh, you avoid also um, conditions like bloating or ecosidiosis in that matter so the intervals is so important and the another thing that you need to also note is um, you need to give your rabbit consistent amount of water as in each and every time you give your rabbit uh, uh, feeds you need to give them water and the for the amount of intake of water will primarily depend on the amount of uh, on the type of feed that you give your rabbit if it's dry matter then your rabbit will be able to take a lot of water but if you are giving your rabbit greens be rest assured that your rabbit will not give, get uh, large, uh, um, uh, large amount of water will not be co consuming large amount of, of water in that matter so it's important for you as a farmer to always know the kind of feed that you give your rabbit so make sure that it's in the proper interval and you can be able to utilize such kind of uh, feeding system so thank you for your time it was just a short video to explain to us as an interval at which you give your rabbits a uh, feed so always subscribe to our video and uh, check for new each uh, for the new videos each and every week we upload our videos so thank you for your time and god bless you